Good morning, everybody, and welcome to the video of the day, which is replacing a fuel pump, fuel sending unit on an 07 to 13 Silverado. Um, I'm going to show you how to do it my way, not the uh, OEM way. Let's get to it. Step one, take your negative terminal off the battery. Done. Step two, you're going to take everything out of the bed back rack toolbox bed liner cover you're going to get yourself a angle grinder and some tin snips and a drill bit maybe a half inch drill bit you're gonna make something that looks like that it ain't gonna look pretty but it doesn't matter because you're gonna throw your bed liner over it what i did because i was scared my high pressure line right there is what's leaking so uh, I drilled a hole in every corner and uh, cut it open with tin snips most of the way, peeled it back a little bit, and uh, then I was able to shove some cardboard in there, and it was taking way too long, so I busted out the angle grinder, cut myself a hole. Um, and uh, yeah, let me show you what you'll need next. So this is what she's going to look like, and... Uh, I'm no genius, but I'm sure you're not going to want all that crap in there. So grab yourself a shop vac, and uh, let's vacuum uh, all that out. Worst case scenario, it doesn't vacuum all out, I'll have to get the air compressor. Blow it all around. Alright guys, so uh, this is the best camera angle I got. Like I said, I've never done this before, but I couldn't imagine it's too complicated. Um, I'm just going to be removing... Um, a bunch of uh, lines so these I don't know what you gotta see here I'm assuming it's some sort of tab something feels like a tab I assume this green thing has to come up here and you push those in and pull it up maybe oh looks like we're getting something Like I said, this is going to be raw and uncut because uh, I don't know what I'm doing, but we're going to figure it out soon. I assume, there we go. Ho oh, ho, one down, baby. Now I got these things. These are supposed to be for this line. We're going to worry about that one last. Oh, just almost absolutely destroyed my hand on this knife. Close her up. These are like every other connector. I assume. Pull that back. Give her a pinch. Now you just got to be careful here. If you're cutting this like I am, this is all razor sharp. So keep that... Uh, keep that in mind because I'm not trying to lose my hand here you know in uh, in videos I actually prefer to uh, watch this all through because they could say just take it off but if you're absolutely struggling like me it helps you see what the heck is uh, actually going on. I don't know. I assume this is like a push one, but it ain't going to be pushed too much. That one pulls right off. This one's got some whoop de doo clip in it. And I think you need to take this. Pry that up, maybe. Like I said, be careful. This is all razor sharp here. I don't know. Close that up so I don't slice my hand again. First, gonna pull that whole piece out. Oh, I think that's it. There you go. So you gotta pull this little clip thing out, and she slides off. Put that back in, or else we will. Uh, We'll never be able to find that. 
you'll probably want that. Slide it in like so. Sorry if this is boring, guys, but uh, I want to give you the real world experience here. Alrighty, guys, so I cut the video because uh, it took me like almost three hours to get that stupid ring off the uh, fuel pump, but let me flip it around and show you how everything in theory works. So this connector comes off, um, just pry on both of these sides with the screwdriver and it pulls right off. Um, this line was the one that I was using those, I had those fancy tools for this line right here, currently waiting on the fuel line to come in because snapped off in there and I don't know if you could see, but I've tried everything to pull it out of there. It's not coming. So when in doubt, buy another one. Um, this ring, I bought a new ring because man, oh man, was this thing rusted on. You're supposed to be able to tap it with the brass punch. I tapped for literally an hour and a half straight. Okay, so what I did is online, you can buy a tool for 20, 30 bucks, but I didn't have the time, so I decided to make one. Um, this is what it looks like. It ain't the prettiest thing by any means, but it worked. Um, put the impact on that. This uh, went in there like that, like that, and then rip it, and it's a whole bunch of torque. Spun it off finally. So yeah, if you don't have one of these, and your truck is uh, 2013, or even worse, and you're from a uh, salty state, you should uh, probably invest in one or make one if you have the capabilities. But uh, yeah, so now I'm just uh, waiting on this fuel line. It's supposed to come in uh, tomorrow. And uh, yeah, then she'll be back up and running. And uh, it kind of was a pain to get this back on, but it uh, it worked, it's on. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna get a piece of sheet metal and just uh, zoop, 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 self tap her in. There's enough room. And uh, throw the bed liner back in and uh, reinstall the back rack and such. And uh, yeah, we'll be mint. So yeah, let me uh, get back to you when I uh, snap that sucker in. All right, guys, I know that wasn't the best video, but uh, it was a video. Um, to be honest, I was more PO'd at the whole thing. Getting that stupid ring off uh, was nearly impossible because of how rusted it was. But uh, if you guys have any questions, you know I'm super active in the comments, um, whether it's today or from a year ago. So let me know if you have any questions about anything, and I'll be sure to answer it quickly. And, uh, yeah, bow tie is uh, officially back in action kicking butt um did a nice test drive today runs perfect no gas leaks no nothing so uh yeah i guess uh the next project will be windshield wipers uh the motor must have went because they go um almost comically slow even on the highest setting so uh gonna have to do the wiper motor before winter here but uh stay tuned for that that'll be down the road a little bit and uh yeah we'll uh talk to you guys soon bowtie brem out